UAE-based Al Habtal Group has signed an agreement with Starwood Hotels and Resorts Worldwide to open three hotels in Dubai in a 1.33 billion US dollar overall, adding to the 13,300 hotel rooms that are currently underway in Dubai. Dubai hosted 9.3 million hotel guests and cruise passengers in 2011, up by 10% compared with the previous year, while revenues of hotels and hotel apartments increased by 20% to touch 16 billion dirhams. Located on a 1 million square foot property on the Sheikh Zayed Road, the Al Habtal Starwood development will include the first St. Regis Hotel in Dubai that will feature 241 luxuriously appointed guest rooms, including 49 elegant suites. The new W Dubai Hotel will see 384 stylish guest rooms, including 88 suites, and the new Westin is to comprise of 384 guest rooms, including 88 suites, in total adding 1,675 rooms to the city when they open in 2017. The development will also feature a one-of-a-kind destination entertainment theatre, surrounded by exquisite landscape gardens on over 500,000 square feet of land. The delivery date for this project, as we talk now, the demolishing is uh, ongoing and uh, the excavation is going to take place next week, uh, hopefully. So uh, we are putting uh, the target is uh, too open for our first guest hotel to check in in that uh, hotel or use the food and beverage outlets in the beginning of 2017. But uh, this is only uh, the agreement with the contractor. But once we start uh, coming uh, above the ground on the structure of uh, the building. At that time, we can, uh, we can save some uh, few months. So we are targeting maybe uh, saving between uh, six to ten months. It means that we open maybe beginning of 2016, hopefully. In 2011, there were like 8.4 million people checked in in hotel rooms in Dubai. Uh, the target this year, as per the DTCM, uh, they're talking about something around 9.6 million people checking in approximately, maybe more. And uh, if you can see the figures for the first uh, three months, the people who came uh, in Dubai airport, whether they come through to Dubai or they just transit, the figures have been above last year by a uh, high percentage.